Valentine is two days now after now. There are many people whose lives are going to nose dive. I'm not saying there's anything wrong with it, but nose dive. They have not even stayed well with God and they look forward, they are planning all kinds of things minus God. They bought flowers, they bought, they, they paid for the venue that they will use, and there is no God in that factor. God, I'm used to you interrupting my joy. Stand back. When I need you, I'll come. This one now, it, look, let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, it is the foolishness of loving God that brought us this far. Never get to a point where you become too intelligent, too Western to become that baby. Are we together? There are many people right now, it's pedigree and, pest, and prestige that has come to a point where it has replaced God and pushed God out of their lives. You know, when we started, we were poor people, no money, but now we're billionaires, we're talking serious things. My phone can't fall down, my clothes, do you know the amount? And while you talk all that nonsense, the realm of the spirit is watching you. The rich fool in one day came down his life was even demanded from him ladies and gentlemen please hear me your passion for god is not about fanatism and it's not about being a preacher do not leave passion for god to just pastors and preachers and say me god has called me into entrepreneurship he knows that i can't love him the way who told you that go and find out the people who love god as governmental figures like daniel as economists like joseph they were not preachers yet you could not argue their love for god the question god is asking you right now is simon bajona lovest thou me more than this because the way many of us are pressing into life we're ignoring god we're just satisfied that at least i remember coming out for an altar call and i don't care about anything spiritual but if we begin to talk about money and business and rising, now you are speaking my language. Some of you, your love language is money. Repent. <laughs> Repent. Now listen, please, don't, don't, I'm not being sarcastic. I'm serious here teaching. Are we together now? Repent. You are the first. You are the street, you are the hunger living inside of me, you are the food that satisfies, you are provision for the journey of my life. Hallelujah. I will keep saying it for as long as I am alive. I will give up koinonia and close it down a thousand times to maintain my relationship with God. Believe me, this is not just a, an empty talk that I'm saying on stage. Are we together? Something more than gold. I've got something more than gold Something more than gold I've got something more than gold If all I have is Jesus I've got something more than gold I will tell it to the world So the first dimension of relationship you want doors to open for you it is with god with god the first dimension of relationship and let me tell you this you are here and you've not encountered the god of the bible when i make the altar call i want you to run wherever you are just know that this is why jesus brought you here give us john 17 verse 3 it says and this is eternal life that they may know thee not that they may recite a prayer alone this is eternal life that they may know thee the only true god i have searched and searched all the earth 
searched and searched all the earth and found the Babu Wani Kamaraka. I have searched and searched all the earth, searched and searched all the earth and found that until you get to a point in your life, ladies and gentlemen where god means everything to you your love and your passion for jesus your love and your passion for the things of the spirit has consumed you and is above every other desire then you are not ready for the relationship that opens doors there are men who will stand in an empty space but because of their love for god he will carry a door wherever it is bring it in front of them and open it that is how far he can go he said i have loved you with an everlasting love and i have drawn you with my loving kindness it's time to return back to your love life thank god that this is a period that is celebrated world over it's a, it's a period of love your first love is not your husband it's not your wife it's not your children it was because of him that they all arrived don't let their presence drive him Are we together now? Jesus, the lover of our soul. This is how we started. Blind, sincere, honest pursuit for him. Lord, if you never bless me, you still have my all. If you never lift me, you still have my all. Not Lord, I'm giving you two weeks. If you don't move, don't blame me. All those kinds of things. No. I love you sincerely it is not about preaching it is not about all of that no the song we sing they all belong to you and even the air I bring to lay your hands on your head in one minute and repent from every kind of idolatry lord i don't know what has taken your place in my life the pursuit for things the pursuit for fame the pursuit for money the pursuit for positions cry to the lord this night I return I return oh lover of my soul oh lover of my destiny I return church stole my heart from you marriage stole my heart from you a job stole my heart from you fame stole my heart from you naira and cobble and dollars and pounds stole my heart from you but I return someone cry I return I return in the name of Jesus, I return. Shabrekete perekos kati barus, skati prende ke perekos kotu braskiata. Ay akas sabando shodo prekete beleketa. You are praying. One more minute.
Father, I love you more than ministry. I love you more than prophecy. I love you more than marriage. I love you more than children. I love you more than a job. I love you more than business excellence. I love you more than financial prosperity. Someone pray, someone pray. No distraction. Man of God, it's time for your love for ministry to go behind the cross and never replace your love for Jesus. It's time for your love for fame and power, even though carrying the semblance of spirituality, to go behind the cross and to see Jesus alone lifted as an expression of your love. It's good to excel. It's time for your love and your desire for material things to move behind in the queue that nothing and no one should sustain the ability to take his place in your life. Oh, if I perish, let me perish loving you. If I go forward, let me go forward loving you. If I mark time, let me mark time loving you. If I rise, let me rise loving you. Everything I will ever get that will demand my not loving you, may it never come. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus.